nothing to do here. I love their truck. Their truck. Truck's their prized possession. Awesome. Put that down here. And they always run with all the windows down so people can see at them. I don't know why, but that's their thing. Enough of this. My dad pretty much runs around with a dash cam, Ryan. And the other day, I think it was shit yesterday, maybe the day before, the guy comes up to him, Why are you videotaping my truck? As I'm looking for it. Like, what are you talking about? I'm not videotaping your truck. I saw you with the camera. You were videotaping my license plate. That's like, I'm not videotaping your license plate. You're crazy, man. Oh, well, you better not be wanting to steal my truck. He goes, what? Steal your truck? Why would I want to steal your truck for? Well, in my neighborhood, they're videotaping license plates. And then later on, they're putting it in Google. And then... From that, they can tell where you live. So he's saying, he tells the guy, so you saying I put my license plate in Google, it's going to tell me where I live? Yes. No, it doesn't work like that. But again, it's the fucking people around here. They're fucking crazy. And then some of these good old boys with these redneck trucks. Again, that's their prized possession. Their truck, is that it? Some of these people, they live in little trailers. I mean, if they don't mod out that truck with those big tires and the muffler and the exhaust and everything they actually might be able to afford a house but no they choose to live in a trailer but they have this souped up redneck mud truck you know this makes no sense to me but that's the uh the logical thinking of some of these local people in this town i live in i might have shared this too probably shit this is years ago but i won't say what vehicle we were in but we we're in a vehicle we don't use much and um Driving around in the parking lot, again, good old boy, big old lifted Ford Expedition, big old tires on it. All right, the guy's just blocking the whole intersection because he's in a parking lot and wants to get the first spot when there's like five spots next to the first stop, playing first spot. So, honk at the guy, doesn't move. Lay on the horn again, doesn't move, doesn't move, doesn't move. All right, what the fuck is this guy doing? He's blocking up the whole intersection, making a line behind him. All of a sudden, he gets out of his, we pass him get out of his car, he gets out of his car, starts chasing our vehicle, kicks the bumper, starts to grab the bumper, face plants, falls, trips, because he's in flip-flops, it was hilarious, big old freaking redneck guy, but maybe he's watching my videos going, that was me, motherfucker, but that's again, these people, they, they're fucking insane, and I wish I uh, had that whole uh, experience on video, it would have been uh, viral, it's kind of like that guy, you know, when I see that video from a month ago, this girl's up in Tampa. I think she was on 301. I'm on that road frequently when I go up that way. And there's this redneck guy in this big truck riding a bumper. And, um, because she wasn't going fast enough for him. And then he passes her, loses control of the truck, flips her off, and it's totally just wrecks the truck in the middle of the intersection. Again, Florida. But it's funny if you didn't see it. So cool truck. You can't take pictures of people's trucks because then you're going to steal it because you got their license plate on the YouTube. That's right. So the guy says, was that GMC and it has uh, Silverado taillights in the back. It's pretty cool. I like it. You can't get a picture of my truck because then you're going to steal it with the license plate. 